If you have a technology or an idea that can impact millions here, then let's have a chat. Hi, I'm Joseph, the founding partner of Verge Health Tech Fund, the world's first seed-only VC that invests in healthcare technologies relevant to solving healthcare problems in emerging markets. I myself was once a medical device entrepreneur and I thought, man, if there was somebody who could have placed a bet in me at the time, maybe life would have been very different and maybe our technology would be out there right now. One of the companies that we've recently invested in is Acuos, and they make the world's first fully digital bone conduction hearing aid in a destigmatizing form factor of eyeglasses. The way that the Acuos hearing aid works is that it takes sound from the environment into its microphones and then translates it into physical vibrations that go directly through your skull, bypassing your eardrum. Their device works quite similar to a normal bone conduction hearing aid, except it's much more affordable. It's non-invasive, because usually you have to drill a hole in your skull and anchor a box to your skull physically, and it might even be quite stylish. What led us to invest in Acuos, first and foremost, was the team. Their technical prowess, their tenacity, and their coachability. And these are the things that we're really looking for. There are a lot of challenges in investing early in healthcare technology. I mean, the risk of failure is immense. I mean, you have scientific, technical, team, regulatory, productization, commercialization risk. And unless you're really hands-on and can really help guide the founders from the start to the end, it's a really harrowing and sometimes a very lonely journey. It's difficult to communicate this to potential investors who might be really large institutions or family offices or conglomerates. That's really the reason we exist, to help plug that critical funding gap for early stage health tech entrepreneurs, to help them bring about this vision of healthcare that we've been expecting for decades.